when we're engaged by direct selling companies, one of the first questions is, should we go international immediately? Uh, this is understandable because the internet has changed everything. If our clients are selling services, they really can move those services around the world rather seamlessly. Obviously, there are more challenges if they're selling tangible products that must have to be approved. Uh, there's customs issues, tax issues, etc. Our answer to companies as a general matter is you need to realize the cost and expense of truly doing it right. And uh, some companies uh, say we can't hold off the sponsoring around the world. Uh, some companies decide, you know, we really can't afford the costs. We, we're just going to invite uh, distributors from other countries to come to our website, sign up here in the U.S., and we're not really going to deal with the tax issues, the compliance issues, etc., and we're going to just try to stay low on the radar. There's a practical question. Practically, they may not hear from other countries, but uh, if, if you were to ask us for the right answer, that it really isn't the right way to go because every country, just like the United States, has its own compliance regulations. We have our counterparts around the world that we work with if you truly wish to do it right. Our counterparts are in Toronto, in London, in Kuala Lumpur, uh, in Melbourne, in Auckland, uh, New Zealand, in Paris, and Rome. And uh, there are many issues ranging from employment to social insurance to pyramid laws that really have to be dealt with if you're going to do it right. It is very expensive. So our recommendation is first to a company, get your uh, program together correctly in the United States so that you, you're satisfied with what it is. And then let's customize it and take it around the world. Um, we'll be there if you choose to do it in a practical way, but we really can't uh, reasonably advise that that's the correct way to do it.